Yo, Sody, what's up, family? What they doing, G? Oh. You got popping. Oh, man, L.A. L.A., Mr. L.A., you already know. <laughs> no doubt, man. So you know you know we just killed them, man. You know what I'm saying? We just killed them with that on my own joint, man. You know, you got a lot of niggas in Detroit right now, you know, that's filling that joint, man. So... Let's just let let let's, let's just go back, Sody, man. Cause I like when I when I interview niggas that that I consider like friends, man, and and good niggas, man. Yeah. I like I, I like I like for niggas to like just go back, man. Take it back to the format, man. How you know how 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 Sody came about, man. As far as like with this MC and shit and being a, being an artist, as far as like with this rapping shit, man. Let the people know who you is, what you represent, man, and how all of this shit came about. Shit, man. First of all. Nigga, that nigga started singing and shit, man. I was singing in church and all that. You hear me? Word. And so, um, I mean, I started writing R and B songs and shit, man. That's really how my writing began. You feel me? Because I was, I knew how to sing good. So I began to rap and shit when I was doing jail time. Began to run into different cats, but small. Nigga, long story short, um, God bless me, man, with the talent, man. To have my own style and all of that, man, and um. Bring something new to the game, you know what I'm saying? In a different kind of style, though. It's still gangsta rap, but in a different kind of flavor, like funk hop. You feel me? Like hip hop, but it's funk hop. You feel me? Oh yeah, yeah. You know, and I and I definitely feel that, man. Cause you know what? A another funny thing too, Sody, man. Like you know, Unk Unk was telling me, you know, Lil Ma and you know Rick Ross, you know the real Rick Ross. You know what I'm saying? Oh, dude, I don't yeah. know who the fuck he is, you know, but. You know, to the real Rick Ross, the only Rick Ross to me, the other nigga name, he ain't Rick Ross to me, man. So them yeah, niggas was like, just after, that nigga named himself after a bottle, man. Right, man. And niggas, <laughs> yeah, man. And you know, I, I had to do something knowing that nigga too, man. No homo, man. But I had to, you know, I had to send some shots to that nigga away, man. Cause I'm feeling, I told the nigga, man, flat out, if you got problems with, with Unk, and I know you ain't really got no problems with him, man, but. For you not to respect that man, dog, and just, just to steal a whole nigga, a nigga whole life, dog, and, and, and try to not, like, act like you, you, you're not even acknowledging this, man. That shit is kind of yeah, crazy yeah. to me, man. But we going to get off that. What I want to get off into Sody, man, is like, bro, when they told me, they was like, man, boom, this is what I need you to do, man. And uh, it was really, it was both of them, but Mott was on it. Mott was like, yo, yeah. boom, you need to check out Sody. Sody from my hood. We trades, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. That's my nigga. Yeah. Check him out, right? Real, so, real young nigga. Yeah, he told me. He was like, Sody was a young nigga coming up, little badass nigga. He told me, like, Sody was a little bad nigga in the hood. So, I'm like, bet. I'm like, and I checked it out. And the first joint that I heard when I pulled this shit up, man, the first joint I heard, man, was the fucking red and blue joint, man. And I'm like, yo, this nigga get busy. And then I'm like, his oh, whole yeah. fucking, his aura is crazy, man. And so just let yeah. the people know, like, as far as, like, even with that red and blue record, man, and I know you got a you got a heavy hitter on that joint with you, man, which is the game, brother, man. Shout out to Big Phase 100, man. How did that joint come about, man, with y'all being from two different sets? How how did y'all mesh with each other, man? Wow. Be, you know what I'm saying? Um, um, hello? Yeah, I'm here. You, you got me, homie. We here. Um, it's like, um. I'm in states, man, through some, some trying to make a change shit. Not trying, but we making a change, man, with this Crippin' Blood shit out here in L.A., man. You know, I want real niggas and eat real niggas. Try to just stand away from each other, man. Try to combine it all together, man. And uh, so I talked to Big Face Honey and 100 ENT, man. You know what I'm saying? Wow. I learned a lot from Faith just doing music with him and being in the studio and around the nigga and shit, man. So I talked to him, this whole little camp. But um, that blue and red, that blue and red joint, that's one of my favorite songs because I I had I wrote that when I was in Atlanta, like right, my first time out there, just fucking around and shit, and um, I came back with a hook, shit, and I like basically like put the West Coast swag with the South swag because it's like a Jeezy beat, you know what I'm saying? It's like an intro, it's like an anthem, you feel me? So I had to really go in on that, so you know what I'm saying? I took a few ideas and shit from some of my my dogs down south and. And I made it a hot record, man. Face jumped on there, and you know what I'm saying? We made it do what it do. We didn't we didn't try to do it. We did it. So it's a blue and red thing, man. 
Yeah. Blue red make green, you know what I'm saying? Straight it, like that, homie. It, it do, man. And, 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 and one more thing I'm going to say about that, because that whole blue and red record, remember when I first linked up with you, I was like, yo, Sody, I got the whole Detroit fucking with you. I got the whole Miami fucking with you. Like, when I took that shit Straight through like the... That. Yeah, when I took that shit through them hoods, man, all, all up and down, you know what I'm saying? Like, six mile, seven mile. Like, and them was some of, like, the most well-known hoods wow. in Detroit. You know, niggas was like, yo, man, we fucking with this nigga music. And Sody, like, wow. right now, nigga... Like, if you come down to this bitch right now, bro, and I'm not trying to float your boat, you can do a show down here right now, man, and we can get this shit popping, man. Come fuck with us. You know we had Tone Trump out here, and I know we're going to get off into the whole Jeezy yeah, situation. That's, yeah, yeah, that's my guy. That's my bro right there, man. Right. Up to him, man, Philly. You know what I'm saying? West Philly, nigga. Yeah. Yeah. Right there, man. yeah, Philly, get, Philly get it in. So let, let's, let's get right off into yeah. it, man, because... I, I don't look at it. I don't look at it like you, you, you lucky. I look at it as like you a talented dude, man. Let's talk about like how did the whole situation with you and you know the big homie OG man, Young Jeezy man, like like how did how did that whole situation come about, fam? Shit, that was like on some real street nigga shit. Like on some, I'm about to go to Cali and go grab me one of these real young pit bulls, a blue pit, and get it cracking and take over Cali. That's how it was really brought about. But it was some my homies and. One of Jeezy homies out there in prison in Georgia had a connect, and they was watching my videos over the phone. So he had told Jeezy, you know, you need to go fuck with Lil Sody, you a real one. And I am. All my big homies and my G's will vouch for me. So I really lived that life. I did it. I don't just rap about it, you know what I'm saying? And I don't rap about shit and that a, a nigga lying and all of that. No, I tell the truth about everything, man, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Nigga really from the ghetto. I'm like Boosie out here, you feel me? Word. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So y'all heard it here first, man. And listen, y'all, this is the homie, man. Young, not not young, my bad. This is Lil Sody on the phone with me right now, man. And y'all make sure y'all follow him on Twitter. Mr. Him, Mr. Him. You know what I'm saying? And make sure y'all go follow him on Twitter right now, man. His, his Twitter is at Lil Sody 831, man. That's them Trey niggas, man. Them niggas is doing the thing. And Sody, before we get back off. I'm sorry, go ahead, bro. Shouts out to all my niggas in Detroit, too, man. No One doubt. to all you niggas straight from Cali, nigga. This little Sody, Mr. L.A., nigga, CT World, nigga. Let's get it. Yeah, y'all heard it here first. And Sody, man, you know I got you know I got one of my home team niggas out there. He just got out there tonight, man. My nigga Mo Dirty, man. He he should. He, 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 oh, yeah. He, yeah, yeah. I, I think I hit you on the Twitter. You know what I'm saying? But make sure he, he down there. He going to be down there for about two or three weeks, man. So I'm going to link y'all up. Oh, yeah, he's going to link us up. Already, yeah, link us up, man. I, I already told him, like, man, you good money when you get out there. So he already, man, he looking forward to meeting you. He looking forward to meeting Uncle Rick, man, and everything, man. So, so we about to get it in. You heard? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And I'm feeling good all of that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no doubt. So, Sody, another question I want to get off into, man. Let's talk about Let's talk about the video, man, that you got, man. Excuse me, man. Don't even worry about that. But yeah, let's talk about what, what what's this new video I just seen? You got my man uh Freddie Gibbs off in that bitch with the with the Hummer with the oh, uh, yeah. what's, what's going on, fam? Oh uh, yeah, man. You know, shit. I was basically talking to the streets, man. Streets That's talk. That's how it is right here. Yeah, man. I'm talking to the streets and the streets talk back to me. That's why I'm still here and I'm I'm still surviving out here. I don't go by say or what a nigga telling me. And all of that shit. I, I, I go, I talk to the streets. Because the streets is going to be here when we all leave. You feel me? Word. We got to respect the streets, homie. So that's dedicated to the streets, homie, and all the ghettos, man. Streets talking, nigga. Yeah, yeah. So y'all heard it here. And y'all make sure y'all can go on YouTube right now. Just put the homie name in YouTube, man, in that search. Put Lil Sody, and everything will pop up, man. And I done seen a lot of his videos from the On My Own video, from the Chevy video to the to the streets talking, man, and the shit crazy. And so, you know I'm coming out there next month, right, fam? We finna get busy, nigga. I'm coming out yeah. there. I got I got Unc, I got Unc Ross setting some shit up, man, so I need you to come in them shows. We finna do these shows together, my G. Uh, oh, yeah, man. I'm gonna be out here, man, like I said. Uh, shit, I was down for a minute, you know what I mean? Fighting something serious, but God blessed me and brought me up out of there, man, and, uh, Shit, I'm on a half a million dollar bill right now, so I ain't going nowhere. I'm going to be here when you get, get it in, you feel me? Right, no doubt. Hey, Sody, man, so and you know what? And I'll never bring shit up like that because that, that shit be, like, too personal. But, like, yeah, I, I know a lot good. of my people, a lot of my people did hear about that shit because... 
Like, they seen me yeah. tweeting about the shit because I didn't even know. And it took for Lil' Ma to text me, man, like, you know, Sody down right now. And I'm like, word. And I put a tweet up, man. And you can ask your wifey, man. And tell the wifey I said it's all love. She was holding you down, man, like oh, a yeah. real wifey should do anyway. And I was like, is the homie all right? But she seen, she seen I was down about it. Like, yo, what's, what's up with my homie? So, Sody, we can get off yeah. into that a little bit, man, as far as, like, we ain't got to get off into the case or nothing like that. But like you said. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's all good, um. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you, fam. Yeah, my, my service kind of fucked up, but, uh, shit, man, they tried to put a murder on me and shit. They tried to falsely accuse me for it. I beat that, so now they got me fighting something else. But God is blessing me, you know what I'm saying? He walking with me through this shit, man, and, uh, thanks to my family and split a real old hood rap. Shout out to they camp, you know what I'm saying? Them bloods, the hood raps and all of that, and Young Jeezy looking out for me, mommy helping me. Make this bail, and you know I'm saying, get out here and fight this thing from the streets, and continue to work on this music. I got a movie, two movies coming out that I'm going to. Uh, one with Jeezy and Snoop Dogg, well Snoop Lion, um, and it's another one we got. But uh, man, I'm looking, I'm working right now, man. So look forward to you know what I'm saying, seeing a lot of work for me, man. That's what's up. So, Sody, man, what we gonna do, homie? I'm finna get off into this joint, the one that you got with Big Phase 100, man. So, what I'm gonna let you do, man, get your shout outs <laughs> real quick, man. Get your shout outs, <laughs> my nigga. Man, do the LA for me, man. And just let yeah, people LA, know where they can yo, find you. Yo. Let them know where to find you at, Sody, man. You, you got the mic, man. Tell the people what it is man. and introduce this new record, man. And stay on the line. Man, shout out to all Detroit once again. Thank y'all for y'all love and support. This little Sody, all the neighbors know me. Mr. CP World on the West Coast, California, South Central, where you find me. You can look me at, at Lil Sody831. You told me, Google Lil Sody, everything gonna pop up. Shout out to the whole CP World camp. Me, Freddie Gibbs, JW, Tone Trump, Who Rossini, Sprilla, Slick Puller. You know what I'm saying? It's the world, baby. Shout out to Big Homie Big Easy. Shout out to Uncle Freeway Rick, my homie Ma. Shout out to Big Fan, favorite ENT, one of ENT, Big Face Honey. You know what I'm saying? This the joint. That's this this my single on my on my new mixtape called Blue and Red, Red and Blue. Blue and Red make green. Little Sody featuring Big Face Honey. L.A. Y'all know what it is. L.A., y'all heard him, man. So once again, man, I just the homie on the phone. Lil' Sody, he told y'all what the shit is, man. Blue and red, red and blue. Red and blue make fucking green. So let's get off into this song, man. Blue and red, red and blue. Lil' Sody, L.A. Red and blue. Let's get it. Stay on the line, my nigga.